Hello, this is Victor from Black Pisces Production, and you're watching the How to Mix Power Metal video series. In the previous video, we talked about the drum room track. In this part of the video series, I'm going to show you the processing on my drum bus. But what is a drum bus, you might ask? The answer is really simple. It is a groove track that is used to merge all drum channels into one. I named mine Drums. The first insert on this channel is the virtual mix rack plugin with the VCC mix bus and the FG401 modules. The VCC mix bus is set to group 8, just like the VCC channel modules in the previous parts of the video series. The settings are the following. Brit end mode, drive at 9 dBs and input at minus 6.3 dBs. After the VCC channel I use the FG401 compressor with the slowest attack, the fastest release and 2 to 1 ratio. I set the mix value to 26%, this means that in fact I apply parallel compression to the drums. If you don't know what parallel compression is, let me know in the comments below and I will make a video about parallel processing in the future. Parallel compression can help us get more punch out of the drums. The second insert on this channel is the Infinity EQ plugin. This plugin is used only to remove frequencies below 25.5 Hz. I like to cut out unimportant low frequencies because this helps me create tighter low end. When I bypass the plugin, you will see on the analyzer how much unnecessary information was removed from the signal. And now a before and after comparison of these two plugins. Today I showed you the processing on my drum bus. This was the last video in the video series about the drums. In the next video, we are going to take a look at the bass guitar. Don't forget to subscribe, like the video and leave a comment if you enjoy this content. Thank you for watching, I hope to see you in the next video.